In the world of fighter jets, one name stands above all others, the F-22 Raptor. More than just an aircraft, it's a symbol of American air power and dominance. The Raptor is widely considered the most capable air-to-air -air fighter ever built. Its reputation is almost mythical. Pilots speak of its capabilities with awe. Adversaries call it a ghost. It appears, strikes, and vanishes, designed for one mission total sky dominance. As a fifth-generation fighter, it combines advanced stealth, supercruise, and integrated avionics, features that remain the gold standard. Every line and surface is engineered for stealth, making it nearly invisible to enemy radar. Its engines allow it to fly supersonic without afterburners, conserving fuel and maintaining speed. The F-22 is operated exclusively by the United States Air Force. No other country has it, and none ever will. The U.S. government fiercely protects its technology, treating the Raptor as a national treasure. This exclusivity has made the F-22 an object of intense curiosity and desire among allies. Born from Cold War lessons, it was designed to counter threats that were only theoretical at the time. The result, a fighter jet so advanced, it remains unmatched decades after its first flight. The F-22 is the ultimate insurance policy in a dangerous world. It's the apex predator, hunting alone in service of one nation. Understanding the F-22 is understanding America's commitment to absolute air superiority. The F-22 Raptor story began in the early 1980s, as the U.S. Air Force sought to outpace Soviet threats. The F-15 Eagle was king, but a new jet was needed. Enter the Advanced Tactical Fighter Program, Lockheed's YF-22 versus Northrop's YF-23. After intense testing, the YF-22 was chosen in 1991 for its agility and stealth. Production was long and costly, with only 187 F-22s built before 2009. The Raptor's origins are a testament to America's drive for air superiority. The U.S. refuses to sell the F-22 to protect its technological secrets. The Raptor is packed with classified systems. Its stealth materials, airframe design, and integrated avionics are all closely guarded. Even sharing with allies risks leaks or espionage. Its radar, the AN-APG-77, can detect threats at extreme distances, and its software fuses data for unmatched situational awareness. This first look, first shot, first kill advantage is something the U.S. won't give away. In 1998, Congress passed the Obey Amendment, explicitly banning F-22 exports to any foreign government. Lawmakers agreed. The Raptor's edge was too great to share. Keeping the F-22 exclusive ensures American pilots always have the upper hand. If other countries had it, U.S. forces could face their own best technology in combat, a risk the Pentagon won't take. The F-22 is a strategic asset of the highest order. Its monopoly guarantees U.S. air superiority for the foreseeable future. Even America's closest allies are denied access. The Raptor is America's ace in the hole, and it's not for sale. This policy sends a clear message. Some advantages are too important to share. The F-22's secrets remain locked away, ensuring U.S. dominance in the skies. For America, the Raptor is simply too valuable to let go. The F-22's reputation and exclusivity have made it the most coveted jet among U.S. allies. Japan, seeking to counter regional threats, made repeated requests to buy the Raptor, offering premium prices and co-production deals. Despite their close alliance, every request was denied, citing the need to protect sensitive technology. Australia, another trusted partner, also sought the F-22 to modernize its air force and patrol vast distances. Like Japan, Australia's requests were firmly rejected. Even Five Eyes intelligence partners couldn't get the Raptor. Israel, always seeking a qualitative edge, was also turned down. The refusal to sell the F-22 to even the closest allies sent a clear message. This jet is for America alone. The Raptor's status as an unobtainable asset only adds to its legend. Allies had to settle for the F-35, a capable but different aircraft. The F-22's exclusivity has shaped global air power decisions. No other nation has a dedicated air dominance fighter of its caliber. The Raptor remains the world's most wanted jet, out of reach for all but the U.S. Its legend grows with every denied request. 
The F-22 is not just a weapon, it's a symbol of American resolve. For allies, it's the ultimate what-if. For adversaries, a constant threat. The F-22 is a masterclass in stealth, speed, and situational awareness. Its shape and special coatings make it nearly invisible to radar, allowing it to strike undetected. Twin engines provide super crews, supersonic flight without afterburners, and thrust vectoring for unmatched agility. Its advanced sensors and avionics fuse data into a single clear picture, giving pilots a godlike view of the battlefield. The F-22 does the thinking, letting pilots focus on the fight. This fusion of invisibility, speed, and information dominance is what makes the Raptor so lethal. In air-to-air -air combat, nothing else comes close. Compared to other fighters, the F-22 stands alone. The F-35, sold to many allies, is versatile, but not as fast, agile, or stealthy as the Raptor. The F-22 is a pure air dominance machine, built to win the skies. Russia's Su-57 and China's J-20 are impressive, but analysts agree they lag behind in stealth, sensors, and engine technology. In exercises, F-22s routinely achieve staggering kill ratios against fourth-generation fighters. Pilots of older jets often never see the Raptor before they're shot down. The F-22 isn't just an upgrade, it's a generational leap. Its presence changes the nature of air combat. Adversaries are still trying to catch up. The Raptor's dominance is clear every time it takes to the sky. It's not just another fighter, it's the benchmark. Today, the F-22 is the U.S. Air Force's premier air superiority fighter. With only about 180 jets, they're reserved for the most critical missions. In any conflict with a major power, F-22s would sweep the skies of enemy fighters and air defenses. Their presence alone deters adversaries and reassures allies. The Raptor acts as a quarterback, gathering intelligence and sharing it with other aircraft to make the whole force more lethal. Despite its age, the F-22 is constantly upgraded with new software, sensors, and weapons. It remains the guardian at the gate, ensuring U.S. air dominance wherever it's needed. The F-22's reputation is a weapon in itself. As long as it flies, America's skies are secure. The Raptor is still the tip of the spear. Keeping the F-22 exclusive has cemented a technological gap between the U.S. and the rest of the world. Allies have turned to the F-35, but none have a true air dominance fighter like the Raptor. The F-22's legacy is its influence. Stealth, sensor fusion, and networking are now the standard for future fighters. America is already developing the Raptor's successor, aiming to push these advantages even further. The F-22's exclusivity is a clear statement. Air superiority is the foundation of U.S. military power. By withholding its best, America ensures it can dictate the terms of any future air war. The Raptor is treated with the same protection as nuclear secrets. Its story is a lesson in the value of technological superiority. By denying even its closest friends, the U.S. preserves a critical edge. As long as the F-22 flies, it will do so for America alone. The Raptor is a silent guardian, ensuring U.S. command of the skies remains absolute. Its legend endures, unmatched and unchallenged.